what's it like recording an album as opposed to an EP? Uh, well, I guess well, there's more songs, which makes it a little bit more complicated. He did a considerable amount of pre-production, bit of demoing, and sort of analysing each and every part and seeing if it works. We've had um, a lot more time to kind of get the sound we want and to record the songs um, how we want them to sound. Um, in the past, we haven't had the pleasure of doing that. So it's been a rush, so um, no, it's been really good. You spend more time in the studio, more time in the studio, you, know, you can do your head in after a while. <laughs> uh, you know, some people hate recording, I, I, I enjoy it. A question for you is, how's, how's today's session going? Oh, it's been fucking going. <laughs> Yeah? <laughs> What's been the highlight today of today's session? Rindos, the pink massive band. cock. <laughs> Massive schlong. But there are times where it can be really frustrating. There are times you walk into the studio and just nail it. The magic appears. It's like being, you know, on stage. After a while, you're just like, yeah, fuck it. Let's just finish this thing off. My experience with it has been very good. I've enjoyed it. I've managed to do all my drum tracks within two days. The raw sound, natural tone, everything is um, very good, very clear, very powerful. There's a lot more things where we can afford to experiment on and add to that we always basically wanted in the songs. We got Al, the Axe, Phillips to do congas on You're So Vicious. Also Michael Barry um, done some harmonica for You're So Vicious as well. And we got uh, Chris Ball to uh, play some saxophone on the track Good To See Again. And we are uh, opening up the brand new uh, subgenre called um, uh, Death Harmonica. Uh, yes. I reckon that's death harp. It's about time, isn't it? Yeah, hell yeah. Very, very happy with it. I'm really looking forward to hearing it and getting it out there. So the album got mixed by Tommy Vitelli from the band Coroner at New Sound Studios in Switzerland. Um, really happy. Um, done an awesome job. Put all the kind of magic touches on there, and sounds great. This is great shit. <laughs> It. And it's a lady, lady, lady Gaga. Like you know, she just said to me, like, man, you gotta wear that thing. You gotta it's wear gonna, that. Gonna, thing. You gotta wear that thing like you own it. <laughs> ha. Nice. What are you doing with that tennis ball? Well, you know, when I'm actually in decent company, I do something which is perfectly acceptable in public. I'm recording my own tracks for four songs, and what I found out is, oh yeah, this just sort of bring to it. Yeah, and if you wanna play the tambourine, everybody say, oh yeah! Something like that, something like that.